Hey everyone, it's your girl Kiki, and today I'm coming to you with a what I want for Christmas video. So I know it's like November, but like Black Friday's like in two or three weeks, and I need to get my Christmas list together before Black Friday, right? So, um, of course, disclaimer, like, I really don't need anything. All I really want is to have a great holiday with my family, um, you know, have some time off work, have that nice little, I think, like, four or five days off work, and just really enjoy my time with my family. But, of course, like, these videos are super fun, super cool to watch and make, and really, like, 90% of the items I'm doing for me so I can check when Black Friday comes to see if they're on sale. And also I think this would be a cool idea to give like other people ideas if their family is asking them for a Christmas list just to give you an idea of like things you could ask for for Christmas. So without further ado, let's get into it. The first thing that I want for Christmas is Lily Lashes. I'm literally obsessed with these lashes. Like, they are bomb.com. Like, all that in a bag of chips. But they're like $30 a pair. And I'm like, am I really about to pay $30 for lashes? I don't know. So, I really, really want these um, Lily lashes. Um, I really like the style Mykonos and the style Miami. Next is I want like a wireless phone charger. So like you guys know, I just got the iPhone XS and it has wireless charging. And so I don't have a wireless phone charger. The closest thing I have is like my mom's car comes with the wireless phone charger so I can like use that, but I don't have my own wireless phone charger to use. And I think it would be really, really cool. So I want that. So next, like I actually really, really want this so like my whole life all I wear is like forever 21 uh target H&M sunglasses like I've never owned a pair of nice sunglasses so I really really want a pair of like really cute Ray-Bans like I see everybody like during the summer with their Ray-Bans on looking so cute and bougie and I'm sitting here at my forever 21 glasses like hey y'all um I also want key australia sunglasses to me those are really really cute and they're definitely a step up from like h&m sunglasses but i'm like torn like i'll be happy with either like i'll be so happy with the pair of ray-bans but then i'll also be really really happy with the pair of key australias and i feel like at the same time like am i responsible enough for ray-bans because i feel like even if i had ray-bans i would like drop them and like step on them and then ruin them so i'm like maybe i should ease into like the luxury sunglass life you know get some kia shows that are like 50 dollars then get i don't even know how much ray-bans are but like i'm assuming they're like 150 minimum so okay so this next thing like i really want like i really 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 want and it's a membership to cinemia and so what cinemia is it's, it's basically like a movie like subscription service like I don't know if you guys heard of movie pass but it's basically a movie pass but like a lot more stable so I had a movie pass for the past nine months and I loved it like it was the most amazing experience ever I went to the movies all the freaking time I was seeing like every movie that was released it was awesome like I was supporting movies like I was out here but then, like, you know, MoviePass, like, was doing the most. Like, that could be a whole nother video just talking about everything I went through in MoviePass. So I had to cancel. But I really, really did love the concept. So Cinemia is, like, really, really similar to MoviePass. The only thing is I think they have, like, different plans. So the plan I want is, like, three movies per month. And so even with MoviePass, they said it was unlimited. But I didn't see myself going more than three times per month. So... I think I would want the three times per month one and I hope they have a really good Black Friday sale because I'm definitely going to sign up for it because I miss going to the movies all the time. Like it's just fun to get out the house. It's chill, it's casual, but you're still getting out of the house. So I definitely, definitely want this Cinemia membership. Okay, this is uh, this next thing I do really want. I'm saying this about everything, but like these items, like I really do want. But so I really, um, so... I have luggage right now, and I've had my luggage for about like two or three years, and it's starting to get worn down because your girl be out here, your girl be on trips. So I want like a really cute like luggage set. 
So the ones I like um, are like the rose gold hard shell ones. I really want like a carry-on and a check bag, but I will be happy with just the carry-on because I still have a really nice check bag. So I really don't need a new like big check bag, but I need a new carry-on. And I really want the rose gold hard one. Like I don't know why, but like I really want some new luggage. I'm definitely taking a ton of trips next year. And it's time for sis to level up. Like my luggage is struggling. It's been through a lot. It's time for some new luggage. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> So another thing I want is um, like a backdrop. So a backdrop so when I'm filming my videos I can just like have that backdrop and then I can take like bomb pictures for Instagram, you know, just be out here with a backdrop. So I haven't done a ton of research on like the best backdrops but I definitely want like some type of backdrop so if I'm filming like a sit down video I can just have like my backdrop and then just be able to film the video. Um, I also want like a car mount so I can put my camera or my phone like in my car if I want to record like a car vlog or something along those lines. Okay, so these next items are like low key ridiculous, but I mean, it's a wish list, right? You have to wish, but like I want a Gucci belt. Like I want to be bougie and like there's so many outfits I have that I'm like this outfit would be fire with a Gucci belt. I'm pretty sure the Gucci belt is like three to four hundred dollars. So like I said, it's a ridiculous price for it. But I mean, if you got it, it's not a ridiculous price. But for me, it's a ridiculous price for a belt. So I want a Gucci belt. And then I also want a Gucci fanny pack. Like I have been loving fanny packs like they're on trend and they're so cute and so awesome. So I'm like a Gucci fanny pack would be bomb. But um, all jokes aside, I actually do want a really cute fanny pack, like maybe not Gucci, but like, you know, somewhere like, you know, a nice little cute in the middle brand. I want it in black and I want it to be something that I can just like wear every day and it's my everyday bag. Y'all have no idea how when I'm wearing a fanny pack compared to wearing a crossbody, like my neck is thanking me. Like I have no neck pain, nothing. Like I freaking love the fanny pack leg. So I just want a nice fanny pack. Like it doesn't have to be Gucci, but I definitely want like a nice cute black fanny pack. Totally into this. So the next thing I'm copying from my sister because she put this on her Christmas list, um, but a pair of brown uh, short Uggs in the color, the chocolate brown. So a pair of chocolate brown uh, short Uggs. So I've had a pair of chocolate brown Uggs and I've literally had them for eight years and they literally have just been ride or die with me like life. But I literally um, wore my Uggs to Europe and like they just got ruined. Like I can show y'all actually like they got ruined and I need a new pair. Like it's been eight years. I love them. They're my ride or die. But unfortunately like I need new Uggs. I can't walk out the house with them. Let me show y'all. Just drop one. But I literally still have it in this TK Maxx bag. So, like, if any of y'all are from Europe, shout out to TK Maxx. But, like, this is how they're looking. Like, they are worn down. So, I basically just want another pair of these, but just, like, fresh ones. Because these have been through it. They have been through It's been eight years. They're looking raggedy now. It's not even cute anymore. So, I want a new pair of chocolate brown Uggs. So the next thing I want is a phone case. So I have this really, really ugly phone case. I have makeup on it. But I have this really, really ugly phone case. Like, it's an otter box, so I know my phone's protected. But it's, like, so ugly. Like, I want a cute one. But I want a cute, protective one. So I kind of want, like, the jelly ones that they sell at the Apple Store. But I want, like, a bright one. Like, either bright yellow, bright blue, or, like, a light, like, pastel pink. I think that would be, like, super cute. I really want to try the ColourPop No Filter Foundation. Um, it's only $10, but I think like I want to try it. And I also want another of the ColourPop No Filter Concealer. I already own the concealer, but I just want to try the foundation with the concealer. So I would like like a gift with like the foundation plus concealer. I think that's a really you know affordable gift if you're trying to get your girl something. I'm pretty sure the concealer is $6, so it's basically like a $16 gift. And I know they're going to have a Black Friday sale. So I'll probably actually end up buying this for myself for sure. Like when Black Friday hits, I will be on the ColourPop website. Okay, so that is it for me today. Those are really like some of the things that I thought I might want for Christmas. 
Honestly, for me, the best Christmas gifts are the ones when I don't actually tell someone what I want, but they just listen to me and the things I like, and they end up buying me a gift based on my personality and things I like. Those are the gifts that are like the most near and dear to my heart. So like I said, this list is not all inclusive. These are just some things that I've had my eye on and I would love to have for this Christmas season. And like I said, this these videos are really cool to help you guys figure out what you want to put on your Christmas list. But yeah, thank you so, so much for watching. I really appreciate it. If you're new here, hit that subscribe button um, and turn on your post notifications so you're notified every time I post. I literally try and post every day, but if I don't, it's like every other day. So yeah, thanks so much for watching and let me know what you guys want for Christmas. Um, maybe you guys can help me with my list because... There still might be some things that I want, you know what I mean? And then let me know if there's anything that I mentioned that you still want for Christmas. Alright, see you guys.